in this video i'm going to show you how to color correct your footages especially drone footages in wondershare filmora and this is coming up hello everybody and welcome to the channel if you're new here please hit on the subscribe button if you're old here thank you so much for showing up so sometimes we get footages we shoot outdoors and by the time we get into our editors we realize that the sun was too much the brightness was too much or the white in the video or the footage is too much and for that matter we need to match it to a consistent color we have to make sure that the white and then the blacks the colors in the footage is on a consistent basis so color correction basically is trying to match colors to a consistent standard of appearance that's when you try to balance all the colors in a particular footage so this is the footage that i'm going to use for instance it is from my previous video you can check that video up here now this video looks very pale over here actually like it looks very whitish so what we need to do is we import our footage into wondershare filmora and then we can easily double click on the footage over here and go to the color section and we left click on advanced or if you don't want to go through all this what you can do is you can just right click over here on the footage and then you go to color corrections a shortcut if you are going to do this for many footages because with color correction we do it one clip at a time so ctrl plus shift plus c you left click on it and then it is going to open the color correction part for you now what we are going to do right over here is that we are going to focus on this particular tool the color and then the light over here for instance when you open the light over here we see that the white in this particular footage is very like it's too much for us so what we can do is we can take the white over here and then send them to this particular side it's as simple as that so something like this now wondershare filmora has provided this particular eye over here for you to see the progress or exactly what you are doing so when you left click on the eye you see that this is how it actually looked like and this is what we've done so far now we can also touch a bit of the highlight in here if it looks too much for you or so something like that and then we can drag this one also here as well so we can go back to the eye and check between the two and then we can see that this actually looks quite okay now this is okay for the lightning so let's go to the color over here for the colors we can actually open up the brightness that is this time around we've taken off the white and then the highlight in it so we can actually open up the brightness a little more so that it brightens this one up the more you open up the brightness also you stand a chance of ruining your footage so you can open the brightness a little higher and then you can play around with the contrast as well so every footage actually is separate or every footage would be different the settings for color correcting every footage will be different as compared to the one that i'm using here now the next thing that we want to talk about is the saturation over here so the saturation is basically the intensity of the color that you want inside of your footage so for instance if you start dragging our saturation to the very left side over here you see that the colors are actually moving up a little bit like that and if we drag it to the very this part you see that the colors become so very much but i don't think this is so cool we don't have to make our saturation this higher so we can drag it to somewhere like this so that the greens everything will pop up so we will have something like this one right over here 40 will be so very fine now at this point we are almost through with our color correction is very simple and now we can compare the actual one this is the original one and this is the color corrected footage now when you are done with everything you can just go ahead and click ok but this is a very simple trick over here if you are going to do this for the same type of clips that that were shot at the same place you can save this as a preset so you can save this as stadium so for instance stadium and then i can click on ok 
now once we save it as a preset when you go to the presets over here you can click on the all presets here and go to your costume and when you scroll to the very bottom you are going to see the stadium over here so if it is going to be applied to different footages all that you need to do is you double click on it and then it would apply on on that particular footage once you're done all that you need to do is you go ahead and click ok now this is the previous one let's go ahead and play this and see how it actually looks like now this looks very beautiful so for instance i have the second footage right over here let's say i drag this footage onto the timeline and then when i'm playing from this side it just transitions into my footage right over here like that so you see that this particular footage is very pale now that we have a preset all that we need to do is we can left click on it go to color correction and then we jump straight into presets so we go to presets over here select all our presets and then we choose the costume preset now we can scroll down over here and then we can double click on it so double click and then it automatically applies to that particular footage now let's see how it actually looks like if you have different footages you can just make a preset for all of them so for instance if i left click and go to color correction over here and i go to presets you can see that i have different type of presets that i use for different footages and of course if you want to adjust any of them after you've applied a preset you can come back to the adjustment over here and if this one for instance i want to adjust the saturation of my footage i can easily adjust the saturation And that is how you easily color correct your footages in wondershare Fumora. i hope you gained value out of this video if you did let me know in the comment section and let me know what you would want to learn more in wondershare Fumora so that i will cover that up thank you so much for sticking around to watch this video please don't forget to like and subscribe and i'll see you in the next video it's innocent here and bye